Hello again, Internet. How are you doing today? Welcome to another episode of Renegades React. Today we are going to be doing some epic rap battle. Actually, epic uh, rap battle history. There it is. Oh, hey, this yeah, this guy over here. And uh, well, hey guys, we are the Renegades. Uh, yeah, uh, <laughs> the, the Mad Doctor York has groove. returned. Yep, uh, fresh from fresh off from his uh, binge uh, of uh, Fallout Four that just happened. It's so good. <laughs> yes. It's glorious. And it's so good. <laughs> also, we are joined by another returning member tonight, uh, one who has been out for quite some time uh, due to uh, school and due to, uh, well, it just being the holidays and everything. Yeah. Ladies Life and gentlemen, happens. Mr. Bo Gansman. Yeah. Welcome back, Bobo. Kraft, Kraft macaroni and cheese kept me occupied, too. They, oh, yeah. That, 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 there you go. That Very does leave you out of commission sometimes. Very time consuming. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, well, for those of you who uh, are unaware. I also, I also am the king of Pride Rock now. <laughs> oh, yeah. Look at yeah, that. It's, look at uh, that. there's uh, there's yeah, a lot going that. on there. Yeah, it's just <laughs> pure feathered goodness I mean, he, in his he's, head. He's not quite to, like, the Kraken levels. No, no, no. no. But it's, it's pretty intense. <laughs> yeah. I, I won't tell him you said that. <laughs> Hey, I, I could stick him on it's you. It's pretty. I really in, no, to. I, Micah no, I, knows. Micah, would Micah agree. knows he's the reigning champion. That's but this true. This is pretty intense. That's true. Yeah, uh, but the fact that you're growing here so fast. I mean, heck, last time we saw you, you had a. Yeah. It was like it was like around here. Now it's it's like down yeah. You know. My hair and my fingernails just grow so long. I don't know why. I don't even eat carrots. You have a protein deficiency, maybe. Anyway. I mean, hey, well, carrot. Well, <laughs> rap battles, <laughs> epic rap battles yeah, of history. Had, Let's do this. Now. Okay. All right. First prediction. Um, Gangscom <laughs> versus the Eastern. This is a weird one. This is like one of the first <laughs> this is, weird ones I ever yeah. saw. Pairing. Yeah, that's for sure. Like an odd pairing. I was like, huh. I, I don't mean, really get how that would work. You know, most of the, like all of the other ones that they've done before this made pretty good sense. Like the mm -hmm. matchup made <laughs> some sense. I'm not sure about Sarah Palin versus Lady Gaga. That one, that <laughs> one was a little weird. I mean, it had to be done. Um, John Lennon versus Bill O'Reilly. I mean, yeah, it still kind of makes sense. Bit. And then this one's just like, what are you even talking about? Yeah. Well, there have been historical documents where Genghis Khan has publicly declared his hatred of the Easter Bunny. Well. I'm a history major, so you have to believe me. No, no, I don't. <laughs> no, no. Uh, but we have the rat bow queued up here. Let's All give right, it a watch. Wait, wait. Go ahead. Predictions. Oh, yeah. Who do we think <laughs> is going to win in this whatever this is? <laughs> I this have got to thing. say probably... I'm pulling for Genghis Khan because, I <laughs> mean, least, honestly, at least you don't, he exists, you don't, right? I mean, well, at least, well, at least he Sorry, exists. Guys. And not only that, not only that, but you don't create the world's largest empire. I mean, honestly, he did the impossible. He conquered Asia. Yeah. Nobody else has done that. It's true. It's not I an mean, honestly, easy thing to do. Except, uh, I was going to say, it. wait for it, the Mongols. <laughs> Insert, insert, <laughs> the Mongols. It, just destroying everything. <laughs> anyway. But um, my, my pick is Genghis Khan. Yeah, but but he's so cute. Uh, the Easter Bunny? <laughs> See, so the cute. thing is, I don't no, think... Genghis that, Khan. Oh. No, Genghis Khan. Genghis Khan, Nate. <laughs> I, you know what? I got to go Genghis Khan. Genghis I, Khan? I just, but have you I ever don't, seen the Easter Bunny, though? Like, he could be terrifying. like a rabid monster. Absolutely terrifying. Mm. I don't want if it. If it's anything like that, <laughs> I'd rather deal with Genghis Khan. If it's anything See? like that friggin' See? bunny from Monty Python and the Holy Grail. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, they could be cousins for all we know. <laughs> or like that bunny from Donnie Darko. Ooh, Ooh God. Ooh. Nope. Oh, evil bunny. I still have bad nope. dreams about that guy, man. Roll yeah. footage. Let's Roll do it. Roll footage. Shivers. <laughs> Lloyd. Oh, my God. That's so terrible. My little tail swinging and my big ears flopping. The Easter Bunny, baby, I deserve to be arrogant. You ugly rapist, power and barbarian. Ooh, what you gonna do? You got a bucket on your head and a fool man, too. The Great Wall couldn't keep you out of China. Watch me rub my foot for luck and stick it right up your vagina. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you bunny ass. About Khan's to feel vagina. Around. Oh, silly rabbit, <laughs> you need more than luck. You've got two giant ears but can't hear that you suck. I drive a Mongol horn. Your army is weak. What? You're going to attack me with a posse of peeps? I'll Ooh. fight off your tail and punch your teeth down your throat. Then butcher your family and make a new coat. Oh. Take it easy, baby. No need for this meanness. We should keep it peaceful, homeboy. Jesus. I give people oh. candy. <laughs> you just like to pillage. Why'd you get on my face and go back to your village? From Poland to Korea, I ravage the land. Now my DNA's in dudes from New York to Japan. Ha! Easter my ass. It's You're true. not the Bible. You're a fluffy bitch mascot for Hallmark in denial. Oh, wow. Wow. Poster! Do the song! 
The barbs, man. The barbs. I mean... <laughs> wow, that was delayed. They came back. <laughs> yeah. Wait All right. for it. So... Dairy. Lloyd and... Uh, oh. Lloyd and Peter. I mean... I mean, they, they get into their characters, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the yeah. funny. Oh, my God, the funny. He sounded like a demented version of Mad Hatter from Disney's Alice in Wonderland. Yeah, I can hear but, that. Well, there, it just... It, hello. It, it, was, it was not... There was no way Monster. they could have made it so that the Easter Bunny could win. No. Mm-hmm. At, That's Genghis true. Khan... Well, That's he's true. right about uh, his DNA being in dudes from New York to Japan. Yeah. Because, honestly... Uh, there. As a matter of fact, uh, John Green did this joke. He said, "He said, okay, so oh, it's uh, oh, it's a party popper. Cause oh, it's somebody's birthday. It's Genghis Khan's progeny's birthday. Yay! <laughs> you know what? It's because every day is Genghis Khan's progeny's birthday. <laughs> it's true. Because there nice. are more than nice. thirty million people in the world <laughs> that can trace their ancestry back to Genghis Khan. He got around. He really yeah. did. Well, he did. Well, he did get around. I mean, honestly, and his kids got around too because uh, his uh, his uh, uh, successor, one of his successors, Kublai Khan, had twelve kids of his own, yeah. and, tw- and the, each of those twelve kids had well, the ones who lived had at least four to five kids of their mm-hmm. own, yep. yeah. and it just keeps going. And it, what do Mongols right? love to do? There's two things that Mongols love to do: conquer, pill, and rape and pillage. Uh well, could have gone without that. Yeah. Uh, well, truth hurts. truth hurts. Truth hurts. Anyway. Yeah. All right, so but, uh, I'm glad I stuck by my pick. I mean, the Easter Bunny was okay, but, you know, come on. It's Genghis it's Khan. It's Genghis Khan. Mm-hmm. Genghis freaking Khan. I mean, man. I could have understood Genghis Khan versus Alexander the Great. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's a comparable. matchup that makes mm-hmm. sense. Genghis Khan versus... <laughs> uh, versus uh, Julius Caesar. Well, they Ooh, actually yeah. did Julius Caesar later on. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. With, uh, with, uh, but, yeah, Alexander the Great, I can see... Because he really had like the second largest uh, in terms of, pro, uh, I mean those those two the, both built incredible empires. They actually, yeah, the Mongols actually had the biggest empire. It's just it wasn't like sustained as well as other empires. No, no, it dude, dude, no. The as, Mongols, the like, Mongols sustained it for a long time. It's just eventually, eventually, it just it just dwindled down. I think it was after I think. A hundred, a few hundred years. Now, see, see, when, what, see, what happened is the Mongols were really good at conquering people, but they weren't really good at running things, you know. And that's what they're down. And that, was. that's that's the thing, you know. If you are going to conquer all these people, mm-hmm. you gotta, you have to put in the effort to actually manage all of the mm-hmm. things that you've just conquered. Yeah. And Rome was really good with that. That's why like, <laughs> that's, the Roman that's Empire true. is why uh, we remember it is because they actually held on for so long. Well, and, and, and the uh, other thing about, you know what the you know what the strange thing is? The Mongols and Alexander the Great, you know what the one place they could never conquer was, even though there were many conquests to do it? India. Mm-hmm. Neither of them could conquer India. So those damn elephants, man. And those <laughs> damn elephants the, and the freaking Rajput. I mean, those guys are freaking mean, dude. Mm-hmm. They've been yeah. the guard of in, They've been the Indian guard for pretty much yeah. the last few, uh, the last few thousand years. Yeah, there was a lot of geography that was like a bitch to go over to. Yeah, yeah. I was honestly uh, crossing the Himalayas you know. and all that. Yeah, all I mean, stuff, it's so. like you cross the Himalayas and all of a sudden it's like, oh, we are here to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look, India and yep. Russia. Two places that are just really, really hard to come. Russia was really Russia. Hard. You could never hold on to Asia. Oh, seven extra minutes at the end, beginning of a round, but you could never freaking hold it. I mean, honestly, it's, it's a, uh, all the purples get on Papua New Guinea, just build up and build up and build up. Sorry, I'm, I'm quoting Eddie cool. Izzard, his, no, uh, yeah. his World War II uh, just, and uh, Conquerors. It's cool, but just think right. of, like, people always forget what's the first classic blunder. Never get involved oh, in a land war in Asia. Asia. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. Second only to... No, th- <laughs> but only slightly less well known as this. Never go in against a Sicilian when death is on the line. <laughs> I hope you. Does I wish you would just fall time. off like the no, whole see, way. No, he did I one time. I, I, I would, but I'm kind of. Yeah, I he's can't, just kind of blocked in. If just, I do that, that lamp is going in the floor. And one day, yeah, one no. day your method uh, acting is just going to take hold of you, and you're just going to do it, and it's going to shock us. No, here's <laughs> well, he actually awesome. did it one time before. Oh yeah, really? Oh my god. No, here's the the Wish weirdest time that that ever happened. People were talking about the the Princess Bride at dinner one evening uh, oh, at somebody's yeah, place. Yeah, I remember. And I remember my this. I, this was the first time I was meeting a lot of these people, and I did the line, and I fell over, and my girlfriend just looked at me and went. 
what is wrong with you? This was not long after we started dating. We're still dating, so <laughs> hey, I mean, you made a good I, first impression. A keeper. Obviously. She's a keeper. Yeah. If I was in that di- that <laughs> it was if, pretty amazing. If I was at that dinner, I saw that I would have just started clapping. Yeah. Man. I mean, that would have been just yeah. 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 I would have married. You. I mean, to be fair, I was also dressed as the eleventh Doctor at the time, so that was fun. <laughs> mm-hmm. I um. Oh, it's got layers, Lord, man. man. It's got oh layers. man, yeah. It was. Uh, that was an interesting evening. I'll tell you that. That's, well, that's awesome. I was gonna say. Awesome. So we. So me and Ben picked Genghis Khan. You picked the Easter Bunny. Uh, yeah. Um, mostly, definitely. Genghis. Mostly just to be contrary. I think. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I, that's my nature. But yeah, very, I mean, very if it comes contrary. to who you don't want to see in a dark alley, that bunny was super creepy. <laughs> I'm just saying. Yeah. Like, yeah. like he'll come Khan, at you and just be like, "You want to see where I put the eggs this year?" <laughs> see, Genghis Khan. I'm sure if I saw an alley, he would just. Utterly destroy me. I mean, yeah. He, he'd but just would, sneer at you and just be like, ah! Yeah, he'd breathe yeah. on me and I'd die. But I'd have a noble death, you know, a noble, yeah, but manly I mean, dignified how, death. How much more noble does it get than being killed by Genghis friggin' Khan? See, exactly. But then I if mean, I see. That's, that's pretty BA. Yeah. You know? Yeah, yeah. but I, if I'm in like a dark, you know, dank place with a, a Easter bunny that sounds like this just demonic version of a clown or something. I don't know what he's going to do to my body. I have no clue. Yeah, things, I don't want to know. Things yeah, are, it's things just, are not going to go well for you. He he seems very suspicious to me. At least I don't, I don't you know what him. you're up against. Yeah, mm-hmm. this is true. So, but, so, yeah, Easter Bunny definitely more likely to get a restraining order. So, I don't know. Uh, it's, yeah. it's a toss-up. Yeah, it's a toss up. okay. Just depends. So, anyway. That was, uh, <laughs> that was Genghis Khan versus the Easter Bunny uh, for Upper Rump. Bottle of victory. You're getting better. You're getting, I'm getting better. better. Yeah. No, we're mm-hmm. not not near you or or Peter yet. Gotta get more yeah. phlegm in there. You yeah. Uh, it's, it's not not really, not, it's not really phlegm. phlegm. No. It's mm-hmm. just presentation. It's yeah. how you it's how you do it. I mean, honestly, mm-hmm. I, mostly I can't scream because of uh, you know, this place echoes like a son of a gun. <laughs> so so whenever we get to the outpost, I'll be maybe able we, to do that better. Oh yeah. <laughs> we filmed this. We also this. don't want to clip the audio. <laughs> Yeah. Little well, known fact, we filmed this in a cave. <laughs> well, it is There's a layer. A, that is true. It's a layer. I built this YouTube channel in a cave <laughs> with a box of scraps. <laughs> with a box of scraps and a screwdriver. What did you do? <laughs> I booked... Tony Stark I, built this I booked, in a cave with a box of scraps. That's the oh, best yeah. line. That is the yeah. best oh, line. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah. It's so good. I was going to say... Uh, Ooh, I was going to say... You what the rebel that could that could be it could be, no but I did uh, but I did just recently book a uh, book a night at Holiday Inn Express. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> you remember those commercials? It's yep. like no, I'm not a doctor, but I did just recently <laughs> book a, a night at Holiday Inn Express. But I did say fifteen percent. Uh, scalpel. In my car and Jersey, <laughs> yeah, yeah, there we go. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that was oh, wow. That went off the rails. Really yeah. Right. So That's and on that wait. bombshell, <laughs> it's time to end. Yes. Thank you very much for watching. Good night. Good night. Thank <laughs> you.